Becky, do you care to comment on the allegations that you peed in the washing machine? Are you aware that some of the people who use this washing machine are gay? How will you address your homophobia? Are you aware that urination in a public space qualifies you to be a sex offender? Are you aware that while these people are working from home, their home is technically their workplace, and you licking your asshole inside that workplace is harassment? Jackie, why are you hiding? Jackie, how do you respond to your castmates in the Cat in the Hat reboot demanding you be recast? Jackie, how do you respond to critics who say that only a gym Carrie should play a Jim Carrey cat, and by taking this role, you're silencing the Jim Carrey community? The Jim Carrey community needs answers! Is it true you pay your staff in hisses? Any word on your Netflix special triggered? Is it true you're not voting? Will you still be moving forward playing the Siamese Cats and Lady and the Tramp reboot? And while we're at it, why did you take that role? Those cats were so racist! Jackie, why did you tweet that we're too hard on Kevin Spacey? Why did you tweet the phrase, Bill Cosby, eh? What does that mean? Hey guys, just one reminder, when your parents say don't get into a van with strangers, they don't just mean a creepy old man luring you in with candy, they also mean a long-haired man named Brody, maybe Byron, who is luring you in with um, a border collie and maybe, and maybe a GoPro, alright? You don't have to live the Instagram couple van life, you don't have to. If one of y'all says some silly ass name, this whole class is going to feel my wrath. Now, D nice. Da Vinci? First thing, I, uh, <laughs> I want to make Mr. sure. President, can you let him finish, sir? Sir? No, he doesn't know how to do that. He has, you know, right. he, What does LGBTQ plus mean? Like, is it the premium version of gay? <laughs> I'm pretty sure the plus means like others. <laughs> President, do you condemn white supremacy? Do you like pina coladas? No, Mr. President, I need you to answer this question. I'm getting caught in the rain. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god, girl, I'm so hungry. Oh my god, I am too. What do you want to eat? Girl, I don't know. Something filling, but not too filling, you know? Yeah, I want to feel like I'm hungry and full at the same time. <gasps> Starbucks! 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 <laughs> I'm calling now. Hurry up. I'm hungry. I'm hungry too. <laughs> Hello. Hi, thank you for calling Starbucks. I'd like a cup of water, please. Yeah, would you like ice or no ice? You want ice or no ice, baby? No ice, baby. I'm fine. No ice. No, yeah, dada. Yeah, dada. No, yeah, dada. Yeah, we did. No, you did. Yeah, we did. Your total is going to be $7,672 million, okay? Oh, my God, perfect. Thank you so much. Oh, my God, I can't wait either. Oh, my God, I can't either. Yo, yo, yo. Just the two of us. We can make it if we try. Not kind to interrupt, okay? We need to stay on mute and then wait your turn. Well, and him too. But that's you want not a But he does plenty. Okay, but that's not who I'm talking We're not gonna play together this so we're gonna talk. Listen, who is on your list, Joe? It's we're, it's hard to get any word in with this clown. We're it's calling mommy. Hey man, thanks for cooking. No worries, man. Can you wash up? Yeah, I can wash up. <laughs> What the hell, man? I thought I told you to wash up. I do wash up. Then what's this? Bruh, no. What's this? That's up. Would you say it looks clean? <laughs> Bastard. Perhaps you should speak more carefully in future. Perhaps I shall. It will come in handy when dealing with halfwits such as yourself. Well, if I'm the halfwit, then surely you are the halfwit's halfwit, as you were outwitted by me, the halfwit. Well, if I'm the halfwit's halfwit, then by God, I proclaim thee. What are you guys doing? Can you wash up? Bruh. 
Uh, I'm wondering if anyone's ever had this happen before. I cooked the hamburger, and I was eating it, and I was almost done with my first one, and I felt this pain on my tongue. And so, I went to the bathroom, and I opened my mouth, and there was a bee on it, and it stung my, my tongue. And I don't know how to get the swelling down, so somebody please help me. I don't know what to do. Did you use the word smart? Don't ever use the word smart with me. Don't ever use that word. Oh, give me a break. Because you know what? There's nothing smart about you, Joe. 40. Well, guys, just came back from Arby's. Guess what? They didn't have the meat. Sure hope they learned their lesson. <laughs> That's so weird. <gasps> Dude, whoever has the cinnamon twist in their nacho wins the Xbox that was on the, the menu, menu, the Xbox giveaway. Wait, are you serious? Yes, you need to take, don't throw it away, take a picture of it. Dude. Wait, I need to record this. Guys, she literally Dude, has the cinnamon twist in her nachos. Do? Call the location we were at. Taco oh Bell. God. Type it in, hurry. Okay, okay. Take a picture of it too. No, I am. You guys, she won the Xbox Dude. giveaway. Oh <gasps> what am I going to do? Like, email them? No, call them and say, I just found the, the cinnamon twist. I think I won and see what they say. Oh my when God. When I was just here or just there a couple minutes ago and I had the like cinnamon Dude, I can't twist in the bottom of my Tell them the Xbox giveaway. So oh my does God. that mean like the Xbox giveaway? Tell them you took a picture of it. I took a picture of the like thing. <laughs> so if you bought this me like crazy. send you the picture. What? I've already started building the wall. We built large sections and we're fixing up a lot of other sections that are a mess. So you have ports of entry and we have great security at the ports of entry. And then you may have fencing or walls up and down, left and right, east and west. But I'll bet you as much food as we have. We have pizzas, we have 300 hamburgers, many, many french fries. So maybe you guys can remember that when you say that I haven't spent the money, we spent the money. They can't believe themselves that they got away with it. Did you use the word smart? Don't ever use the word smart with me. Don't ever use that word. Oh, give me a break. Because you know what? There's nothing smart about you, Joe. 40. Hi, thank you for choosing Domino's. Will this order be carryout or delivery? I need you to listen to me very carefully. I need you to get as much raw meat as you can from the back and just put it on the dough. Do not cook it. Do not cook my pizza. Do I make myself clear? No. No? What do you no, mean? No, we can't do that, sir. 
What do you mean? You can't do that. Do you know who I am? Do you know what I could do to you? I want my meat. I want my meat, or I want your head. Why would you want that? Why wouldn't I want that? Who are you? The meat man. And for the first question of the evening, why do you want to be president? I want to be president because I was here longer than any other American. I'm 10,000 years old, literally. I was born in the year 8,000 BC. I came to America on a woolly mammoth across the Bering Strait. I was an American before America was an American. We don't want some rookie who's wet behind the ears and orange. We want someone who waved to Christopher Colombo as he landed at Plymouth Rock. Quite frankly, I want to be president because I think I'm the most fit to be president. You know, you look at Sleepy Joe, it's such a sad story. The guy died two years ago, but he'll never show you his death certificate. He'll never show you that. And look at me, I'm the youngest person you've ever seen in your entire life. I was born three and a half weeks ago in the hospital, and I'm fantastic.